is Timu Walker. I live in Louisville, Kentucky. I'm originally from Hot Springs, Arkansas. Um, I moved up here to Kentucky um, after my incarceration to to humble myself and get away from the, the bad and negative um, stigma from where I was originally from. Um, <clears throat> I was incarcerated from 2001 to 2005. Again, incarcerated in 2006 to 2007. This is all federal time. And then uh, from 2009 to 2017. The legal system uh, really impacted me uh, with my family. Um, a lot to do with my myself as an individual. Um, it, it takes a lot out of you. Um, being being that your self esteem is at a certain level, and then you're incarcerated, and then you have to be put on a different level, and you know the guards and stuff that tend to like like step on you uh, to make your self esteem go down. So my self esteem in itself went down, so that made me go down. But I had to overcome it when I got out. Uh, I just put my hustle mentality into into hustling jobs. I mean, because this is basically the same kind of kind of steps that you do. I mean, you go to work, you hustle the hours, you get a check at the end of the week or the end of the two weeks. Um, but yeah, it, it, it impacted me very deeply. Um, but I had to overcome it and, and put all my um, eggs in, in one basket to learn how to trust people and learn how to trust my family again from, from doing time. Um, I had to change my mindset, my mind, my criminal, my criminal mindset, as far as like wanting to make make that fast money, and wanting to to do do stuff the easy way, take a shortcut out instead of doing it the hard way and 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 reaping from my benefits. So I had to, you know, what I'm saying, just buckle down and. You know what I'm saying? I had my son there that, that, that helped me throughout the throughout my whole time that I've been out. And without him, I don't really know where I'd be at. He's, 20, he's 27 and I'm, I'm 47. So, you know, we're like 20 years apart. So it's like we grew, we grew up like we're best friends. So he, he's helped me throughout this whole time to overcome, you know what I'm saying, where I've been. And then being in, you know, faces of women in prison, they, they've helped me to learn how to bond and learn how to how to trust people for face value without even getting to know them and i plan to bring you know what i'm saying bring, bring change and bring awareness by you know what i'm saying just informing people you know what i'm saying and giving them a better view of who we are and who we're not because they have, it's a very bad stigma on on inmates and and, and formerly incarcerated people they just just want to change the stigma and 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 rebrand us as a people. Thank you.